We started Just Life after 10 years of living in Manchester, but it was always my plan to move back to Brighton. And as we started to prepare for that move with the family, we realised that all the needs we've been trying to meet in Manchester were very present here in the city of Brighton and Hove. Meeting Simon was the first piece of the jigsaw of making Just Life Brighton happen. Over the past 10 years, we've worked with over 2,000 people in homeless temporary accommodation in the city. We're looking to continue to develop and grow our work here, as well as sharing it with our national research and policy network, as we look to build a movement of people bringing about change in temporary accommodation across the country. I'm Sarah. I'm the team lead of the health engagement team. The health engagement team are a team of outreach workers who work in Brighton and Hove with people who are living in emergency accommodation with complex health needs. We support them in a holistic way around all different issues they present with. As they move on from emergency accommodation, we might use other services at Just Life. For example, we have the Social Connection Project where there's one-to-one -one befriending, where they discover more things about themselves, things they enjoy, things that are in the community. We also have the Common Ambition Project. They are a steering group that work together to try and see where all the gaps are, where people might have struggled. So there's a real link between the work that we do there, where we're supporting people to access health services that maybe aren't meeting those needs. Common Ambition are looking to try and see how we can improve those things. The quality of life that I have now with Just Life supporting me has been beyond words, really. I have recently completed a referral to a housing organisation which has been thanks to Just Life and my support worker Tom. Without that, I think my life might have taken a very different path. I would say that Just Life, in the 10 years that they've been running, has become an essential and I honestly believe that they're a life-saving organisation because they've helped people, so many people like myself, and I hope that that continues.